Morning everyone, it is Friday the 14th of September uh, It's coming up at 8 o'clock in the morning So we've done our usual morning routine, everyone's up, fed, dressed Pops are done, pack up's done Recycling's done The bins are out The usual um, So I thought I would just pop on and film a little bit this morning um, As far as I have planned, I'm not going to the gym after work I'm going to come home. Uh, I may well gym tonight because Paul's putting the kids to bed but I'll see how I feel um, but I have no pressing desire to go after work today so I'm not going. Uh, I'm going to show you Mr Blue so I've sorted his teeth, I'm happier with them now um, both hands are done, both feet are done uh, I would have had his tail point made last night but I ran out of yarn about two rows before the end. So I've got some more of that. I just need to go and pull it out of the cupboard. I've got his little crown of pins at the minute. Um, yeah, super cute. So all I've got to do is the tail and the eyes. And he's done. So, super cute. Um, Jack has decided this is his. It's like, is my monster done? Like, what monster? The one you're making? I'm like, who said it was yours? Me. I'm like, oh, oh, okay. Um, so yes, it's Mr. Blue. Um, I took my uh, granddad's blanket. Excuse me. A really itchy eye. Last couple of days, right in the corner of this eye, it's killing me. Um, where was it? Yes, I took my granddad's blanket to my sister's yesterday and crocheted on that one. I had a chat with her because uh, I didn't see her last week. She was poorly, or she was going to the doctor's, and. So yes, good to catch up. I still forgot to say half the stuff I meant to say to her. Do. Um, so yes. That's that. Um, not a great deal to report, really. Um, I may be getting some more clothes later from Paul's place. That would be nice. Um, so I'll tell you about that tomorrow because it will be when he gets home. So I should have finished filming by then. Um, yeah, so work and then home and probably comping. And a nice big sit down and a cup of tea. I think that's what that's what Friday should be for, isn't it? Why do I always have to hug him? He's waving. He's so huggable. He is. It's a lovely size. I don't even know what. Hang on. Hang on. I don't know what yarn is supposed to be made with. Because all these patterns. Excuse me. Sorry for the ropey lighting as well. It's dingy. All these patterns, because they're all from different designers, use different yarn stuff. So. To make your own Mr. Blue, you will need sport weight yarn in blue. Uh, green, black, black. This is how big it's supposed to be then. Four inches, ten centimetres tall, when made with indicated yarn. So I've used DK, and it's probably, I don't know, 15 centimetres, six inches tall. So, I th with Amigurumi, I just go with whatever yarn I've got really, as long as you're using the appropriate hook for your fabric to get the sort of gauge and you want, I don't think it really matters, obviously garments and things like that, it matters, these, it don't really matter does it, that's um, my homage to um, Vic and Bob, Bob Mortimer, I'm listening to um, Bob Mortimer's pop, pop, podcast podcast at the minute um, called Atletico Mints and it's, it's supposed to be about football it's because I was like oh, I'm not listening to that it's about football but it's it's so like loosely based on football they just take the mick out of footballers and you don't even really need to know who they are or why they're taking the mick because it's just Bob Mortimer and he cracks me up and the Andy I think it's Andy Dawson I think his name is he does it with him so funny. It's it's really like random, but the Bob Mortimer just makes me cry. So funny. So there's my podcast recommendation of the day. Um. Also, if you're into more serious stuff, I listen to Case File, um, which is a crime, a true crime sort of podcast. Oh, that's good. I've got, I caught up, so I'm letting a few build up because I listen to about ninety odd episodes, and some of them are multiple parts, like the um. Moore's Murders, that was about a four or five parter, and what 
was there was another one it's about five parts there's one about silk road the dark web one just loads of stuff there's some from hundreds of years ago and then there's some really recent ones so it's, i love stuff like that and i'm not morbid at all honestly but it's fascinating so yes there you go two recommendations and i had somebody comment on my video i can't remember your name sorry i meant to look it up let me have a look she has been watching my video for videos for a few months and she doesn't know my name because I am rubbish at properly introducing myself. Melanie. Hello, Melanie Stitch to my loo. Hello. My name's Kim. Um, I don't tend to introduce myself uh, very often. Occasionally I'll do it on my videos, but I feel really silly doing it and really self-conscious. I don't have it down like some uh, podcasters do, you know. Welcome, I'm blah, 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 known as, you know, I'm Kim. Hi. <laughs> um, yeah, occasionally I, I, I do, like a, for those who don't know me. But yeah, I'm 36. I live in East Midlands of the UK. Obviously, everyone knows the boys. She says I know your boys' names, but I don't know yours. So yes, they are Terminal number 10 soon. Jack's 6. My husband's called Paul. Very rarely makes an appearance in my videos, and if he does, he's usually doing some something some sort of rude gesture to make me have to refilm because he doesn't want to be in my videos but he does insist on walking in the room when he knows I'm filming he knows, he knows or he'll be behind the camera trying to make me laugh because he's helpful like that and he's not at all a child um, sorry I'm just cleaning my phone screen still liking my case it's very pretty very pretty, it's slightly thicker than the other one um, so occasionally I go to pick it up and think ooh because it's thicker on the sides, but good, I like it. So I'm going to stop waffling, because it's gone eight. Um, I'm going to go and see if I can find some more of the blue to make his tail points, and I've got to crochet the tail. I think it's just a little tube. And then um, I can give him eyes, and he's a done, done deal. And then I might get on to making some narwhals. This is a narwhal song, isn't there? My sister sings, every time I say narwhal, she sings a song. We're weird like that, but it's fine, it's fine. Uh, I swear we could have an entire conversation just of, just using film quotes. That's what we were doing yesterday. Um, anyway, waffle. Um, I'm going to go. And um, yes, the hunt for fleece is on. So if anyone has any good ideas where I can buy fleece fabric from, that's not going to cost me a fortune in postage, or I can just go to the shop and get some. Uh, someone suggested a fleece blanket. Who said Wilco or somewhere? But I want pink. I may have to go into town at the weekend, go look at Wilco or somewhere like that. I don't know. Anyway, really going. Really, really. No, you hang up. No, no, you hang up. I will talk to you later. Bye, guys. Hello. Hi, everybody. It's um, Friday. <laughs> it's still Friday. Woo! So it's half four in the afternoon. Uh, the boys are home. Uniform, part of the uniform is being washed. Um, homework's done. So we're, yeah, doing well. Tobin is dancing. Very nice. Um, be careful with that in your mouth. So, um, yeah, I did work. Came home, did comping. Just Pond. chilled out. It was good. Oh, I thought you were saying camping. Maybe possibly no, comping. No, camping. No, comping. Um, Shut the door, please. And I did some work on Mr. Blue. He's finished. Well, I'm going to just put a few stitches in the white. Um, but as Jack has claimed it, I don't have to worry too much. Why have you got your school shoes in here? No, don't do that. You're going to wreck your school shoes. Oh, we were doing it at school. It's well, funny. Don't. Don't tell me you've done that on your school shoes. Take, no, take them away now. Uh, it's what I do is I pull them. He wants to I kneel them. inside his school shoes. <laughs> and I won't like let him. Because really he's had them for all of a week and he wants to put his whole weight on the back of them. <laughs> so he has a tail now. And um, I just went with the one eye because I thought it was quite cute. So I'm just going to tack some, put some stitches in there. And then he's done, done, done. So I assume Jack will claim him. Um, I'll get some pictures for Instagram and I've already that's claimed that. him. No, I've Jack wants him, not you. I've pre-ordered it. No, you haven't. Yeah. Um, so yeah, then I might get onto some narwhals, but I don't know. Don't know. Can you go away? No one wants to hear you eat. Uh, yeah. 
So he's done. Obviously, I deviated from the pattern with the eyes. He should have two, just black. Um, I, as far as I, I remember, it's just sewn on eyes. But I didn't feel like it. So I've given him four, four colours in his eye, like um, or four layers to his eyes, like the um, some of the eyes in the pocket amigurumi book that I've got. So he could sit up there, couldn't he? Very cute. Um, so yeah, that's that's it for today really. Uh, I watched some videos, watched Terry. Hi Terry. And uh, Denise. Hi Denise. I don't think I watched any others, did I? Oh, I watched a bit of uh, Amelia, uh, the Arctic Knitting Podcast. Hello. I don't think she watches. Um, yeah, I think that's it. Yeah. So I'm going to go and um, tidy the stuff from this dude away, sort his eyes out, or his eye out, um, and then it will be time to cook tea and stuff. So I will love you and leave you, I will see you again tomorrow, uh, I think we've got to go to the library and then go to the tip, so that will be massive fun, we might do the tip first then the library after dinner or something, um, but yes, so he was good fun, I like the pattern. Um, so give them a go. This is from the Amigurumi Monsters book. I put a, tend to put a link to it every day. I put an Amazon link. It is available in other places, but I just want to point you to it so you know what the cover looks like and, and who it's by and whatever. Um, and then you can search for it yourself. So goodbye from me. Goodbye from Mr. Blue. Uh, I don't know if Jack will rename it. But yeah, see you later, guys.